When we want to construct a square, we're going to be given a segment to start with. So that's going to be my segment or all my sides for the square. And if we just kind of get a little sketch off to the side of what we want, we should know a square means all the sides are the same. And the angles or the angles are all 90 degrees and the sides are perpendicular. So maybe what I'll start with is copy the segment. After I copy the segment, I'll make right angles, make perpendiculars from that. And then after I do that, I can measure how far up I need to go. And then from those points, it should close in and give me my square. So it's a couple processes to do it. But really, it's only a couple steps. It's copy a segment and make a perpendicular. So if I can do those, then I can construct a square or really any other types of uh, quadrilaterals. Maybe it throws in uh, the need for a parallel or something. But it's really the little steps that combine for the big one. So I'm going to just make a long line, one that's plenty in length. And I want to first copy down my side. So to copy my side down, I need to measure how far I want it to go. It is that much. So I come down here and mark that amount. And this is my first side. Now from there, I need to make perpendiculars that go up. So I'm going to do perpendicular from a point on the line, which if you're not sure about, I do have a video to that one as well. But perpendicular to a point, not on the line. When I do that, I start at this point, and I'm going to make an arc on either side of the line. So one here, swing it around, and one there. Now, those are equidistant from that point. So now I open the compass up a little bit more so it's more than halfway between the two. I swing an arc down from one side and the same arc from the other side. So they intersect at two points. This is going to now give me the line I need to draw for the perpendicular. Now I don't need all of it down below the line. I'm going to go above so there is my first line. Okay, I'm going to do the same process over here for this one. Arc on either side. Open up the compass. I make an arc from each of those new points and the goal is that they intersect twice. Once above, once below. Okay, and there's that key shape again, those two inter intersecting arcs. I line it up. I'm going to draw my line up. So I now have this step. What I need to do now is figure out how far up those lines need to go, where those points end, and that's going to let me close in the shape because I, I, it could go up any amount. But we need to find that distance that we want, and that distance was the one we started with. So I'm going to go that much, up the line, up the other one. Okay, so we're going to go to these points. These points are the same as this segment, this segment, this segment, and this one. So now to finish the square, I'm going to line up those two points, close it in, and there I've constructed a square by copying a segment and doing perpendicular lines.